Storm is coming, casting shadows on the horizon. Cries of change, no warning, lights or siren. Darkened skies are falling, deafening anguish. Enter the abyss, hell is calling. Sharpen your swords, tighten your bows. You were born for this, as you are Spartans. Fly your flags high, give it your all. No fear, no regret to die. Battle for your crest. Fire burns are pumping from your chest. Second is not best. We are more than just man, for we are the Spartans. Welcome back everybody, Pro Spartan Gamer, episode 129. Eight games left in season four, and we are still top of the tree by four points. And it's a home game at Spartan Park to start this episode against Sean Deutsch's Burnley. On paper, it should be a good win for us. Slight change to the formation. We've gone one more advance. And Nietzsche's got the gig today. Arnold just missing out. It's tough between the two of them. Um, and Bartley also pushing for that role. So there's free going for it at the moment. Got plenty of options in all of these areas, really. Well, all over the team. Conti in for Bruno Perez, who's on a down as well. That's the only other thing I know. Should be a comfortable win, but you can never tell on Pez this year. It's a bit like the Premier League this season as well, really. Anyone could win it. We've had some real tough games against ones you think would be an easy win. So there's no guarantee that a wet spot in Park is going to see a goal fast. It'd be nice. We haven't had one for a while. That one heavy defeat to Chelsea and that bad loss to Anderlecht. The only two real upsets in the past 20 games, I think. And Conte, he's always been good when he's coming here. And a great start again. Nietzsche be looking to fire off some real clangers from in that advanced position today. You can hit a ball. GG Fofana, oh, unlucky son, corner kick, stay focused here, good, Carrasco can't get it out, Burnley first to the ball at the moment, oh good save, Butland does well, Burnley unlucky, Break could be on here with Tyve. Oh, what a ball. Unlucky Lukaku. Just stretching for it. Can't get his bootlaces on it. One end of the other in a wink. It's a tough, tough game. Off the line. That was sneaking in. Couple real lucky breaks for the Spartans. Fofana brings it clear. Carrasco, Spartans playing on the counter against side they really should be looking to boss against. Tyvee heads it wide offside anyway. Gotta keep the ball and try and get going here. Real good start to the game from Burnley. They've looked on it. They've wanted it more than the Spartans, and the Spartans are so-called going for Premier League title here. Well out. Ball's on, if we can get Tyvee in behind. Tyvee, 1-0. Tough on Burnley. Really tough. They've been very good for this first half an hour. But you cannot leave the Spartans with a one-on-one -on -one race against Tyvee, he's the fastest player in the Premier League and he shows it then, Lukaku picks him out, just puts it into the space and behind not a particularly brilliant pass but that's how deadly Tyvee is give him a chance, he will bury it and he does fantastic, break was on one on one race, Tyvee going to win that all day long unless you got Usain Bolt at centre half and how composed is he to finish it, fantastic Seen that so many times this year at Spartan Park. Big, big goal. 
as the rain comes down 31 minutes 31 seconds ago timed up Again, dodgy defending, but we get it clear. A couple of times it's looked like it's going in the back of the net, and we've been very fortunate. Got to say that Burnley will feel quite unlucky here, I would imagine. Now it's Lukaku's turn to run in behind. Lukaku! Oh, what a hit! What a hit! Good play from GG. First time hit from Lukaku. Really did. Test the keeper's hands. Half time then, 1 0. The slenderest of leads against a very resolute Burnley side. It's not an easy game, this. We will make a couple changes. Bazaar's been not at his best today. Nietzsche again. Looking for Lukaku. Carrasco, what a lovely goal, flowing move from the Spartans, cut Burnley open and King Carrasco buries it from the Lukaku assist and that's lovely, good play from Nietzsche, ball down the channel, saw the pass on early, played it first time, got in front of his man, great control and then stabbed it in on the volley and hopefully that's three more points. And four wins on the spin after that disappointing defeat to Chelsea. Ross Bartley. Oof. Flashing drive. Just need them to start dropping for him. We need him at his best to be challenging next year. We've got Champions League football here. Pushing for the places. I'd like to bring a real pass with the football in the midfield. Tony Crowe's like figure. There's another option in there if we had someone really good at picking the long passes out. Something we're missing in this squad. We flow and move again. Oh, and Tyvee was coming in on the back stick and he's just putting the side net in. Lovely play. Carrasco looking to bend it again. Oh, Tyvee. So close. Tyvee. Oh, what a goal that would have been if that had gone in the top corner. Amazing player. Spartans keep putting this pressure on. Sides chasing and we will finally... We will end up losing some of them. They won't. Oh, Tyvee in behind again. Oh, he's put it wide. What a goal that would have been again. He's been absolutely on fire today, this man. Look at the crowd standing every time he gets the ball. I think this is probably, even though he got 50 in that first season, probably his best ever season. Growing and growing in statue. Can't believe he's not in the French squad. Bartley's there. Boateng. Finally, Taliska gets his first goal. It was on an absolute plate. And he's got his first spot and goal. Big celebrations here. Good play from Boateng. Good header from Bartley. Nice play there from Taliska originally. Got it off and then this ball rather fortuitously gets through to him. But it does get through to him and then he has all the day and the time in the world to think about it. And he picks his spot. And finally he gets a goal. It's good news. Broke the shackles. Job done here. It, looked like it was real tough first 30 minutes. We got that first goal and since then it has been a lot easier. So important to get that first goal. Bartley. Can Bartley get his first? Oh, he's got to come sometime for Ross Bartley. Been closed a couple times. 
It is another fantastic win for the Spartans. Three goals to nil. Really good win. That first goal from Toivy so important. He took it so well. And then goals for Taliska and Carrasco. Finish the job off. Really, really good. Carrasco gets man of the match. It was Toivy for me on this occasion, I'm afraid. Liverpool and Everton both win. Tottenham lose. I don't know, they weren't up there anyway. Two Manchester clubs win. Chelsea win. Arsenal are beaten by Hull, so they drop off the pack. They are now in seventh place, but it's still relentless from all the top five and six clubs. Still nine points back to sixth, eight points back to fourth, and still four point lead for the Spartans. And we are on the countdown now with seven games to go. Long way that four point advantage stick. Sure, what's coming up next? I know we've got this England squad, but we're not even playing them at the moment, so we're just. It will be a game away at Southampton that will finish this episode and that will be coming up very soon, dudes. So here we are against Southampton. We said it was coming up and boy, we've got some people firing for this game. Let's get them in. Let's get all these reds in and see if we can nail another game under our belts because as nearer we get to completing, getting nearer to the league win, the better, obviously. And we've got some... Plenty of people on ups today. There's five of the front men on ups, which is fantastic news. It really is. Let's go and do this job. A tough trip to St. Mary's, as always. Never easy coming to St. Mary's. If we can win this, it'll be five games in a row. And the relentless charge will continue. And sooner or later, the Manchester clubs behind us are going to drop points. The Chelsea's and that will drop points. They won't keep on being able to win because they will be playing against one another. Torrential rain here on the safe coast. Can we make it five wins on the spin in the league? Probably would take a point rather than losing, but this is the run we were looking forward to because we know we end the, end the season with such hard games. And here's Carrasco. Great play from Lukaku, 1-0. Fantastic start from the Spartans. And Romano Lukaku, what a finish. Really good run from Carrasco. Lukaku had it in a hole and he finished brilliantly. Look at that pterodactyl head. He's not happy. And it's another goal for Lukaku. We'll have to have a look at who scored what in the, at the end of this game maybe and see where they are. But look at this, he had a lot to do. Still 30 yards out, great take there. Brilliant, held off people, and then a fantastic strike. That's some goal, really, taking it for granted. But that is some goal from Roman Lukaku. Couldn't have had a better start. Three minutes into the game, Spartans look really focused at the moment. Look like they know what they're after, and they want their first taste of glory. This team, we said it was a team that needed to see progress every year. We've definitely seen progress in. Season four, good from Bartley. Free kick given. Yellow card as well for Yoshida. Of Bartley's decent at these. Get it around that wall. Yes, he can! We scored from a free kick, and it's Ross Bartley. That's the first goal we've ever scored from a direct free kick on this year's pairs. And it's a fantastic strike from Bartley. We needed someone to take these free kicks, and he stepped up and he's buried it, and that's his first Spartan goal. Need to see it from the other angle, but it looks like it's fantastic. Could be right in the top noggins, I think. This is the angle you want. And he bent it right around. Look at that. What a sweet free kick that is. Bang, bang, bang. Get in there, Ross Bartley. What a strike. What a brilliant first half. So they haven't been in it. Been absolutely destroyed in the Spartans. How it's only two, I don't know. Been fantastic. 
right from the off. Lukaku with a very good goal and Bartley with a really nice second from the free kick. Going to change Bartley's position a minute to attacking mid. Bartley leading the charge again. What a run from Ross Bartley. Oh, what a goal that would have been. Fantastic run from him. Free kick given away from Fofan. He's going to pick up a card and we're going to take him off, I think. Just about to come off. A couple changes going to be made. Don't think we're in danger of losing this game. Southampton's still not really offered a lot. Spartans breaking out. Bartley, tired figure. Can't get it. Get wins it back though tirelessly. Can't get it to Alaska. Full second half really, not a lot happened. There it is. Another really good win and that Ross Bartley free kick will be remembered for a long time. A very good win here on a wet safe coast to wrap up another very good episode. And we didn't even let Southampton have a shot in anger. We didn't have that many, but we've done enough. Bartley gets man of the match. And is that him announcing himself in this side? He played very well. Him and Arnold and Nietzsche all battling out for that midfield. Fofana just holding on at the moment. Look at the captain, probably because he's got those added bits. Look at that. Look at the results though. It's endless from Everton and Liverpool. Is it the same from the Manchester clubs? Manchester United have dropped points. They've only drawn. But Chelsea and Arsenal continue and so do Man City. So really, we've just dropped Man Manchester United off. They've dropped back now with seven points clear of them. But it's still four points back to the second. We've got to play Man City yet, don't forget. We've got to play Liverpool yet and Arsenal. We've now got six games left and that's three of them. We're going to look at the goal scoring charts and everything. Nietzsche's up to an 84. A good month. Three wins out of three. Can't ask for any more than that. Fantastic month, to be fair. People shining. Bartley coming into it there with some dribbles. No one else really head and shoulders. Carrasco having a decent month. Anybody in the team of the month? Yeah, three people, Lukaku, Tivy and Carrasco. Let's have a look at the goal scoring charts and that's what we said we were going to do. The next game is going to be England v France, which we won't have anything to do with. So the next game is against West Brom, another one we should be looking to win. But just want to show you where we are with the player stats and everything. So here they are, 25 goals now for Tivy and 5 assists. Out of 30, what another fantastic season for him. And Romelu Lukaku, 9 assists and 29 goals. He's one off the 30 mark. Fantastic that in the top flight. 7 goals, a good return for Carrasco this year. That's a lot better. Only the 3 assists. 6, six assists from Gea and 3 from Bruno Perez. In those fullback positions. Fofana with 4. Not enough goals from Brazil for me. Nietzsche's got a couple, but that's not enough. 1 from 9 for Talaska. 2 and 2 assists for Bruma. Bartley got his first there. None from Bola from eight yet. None from Yaya Torre. Um, and there's the odds is down the bottom. But yeah, that's where we are then. So the front two scoring goals by the sackful. Um, let's see where they rank in the goal scoring charts here. Well, there you see Romano Lukaku with 23. He's only two off. Oguero and Toivi with 17. Very good indeed. Anyway, that wraps up this episode and we'll see you very soon for episode 130 when it will be the games, two home games against West Brom and Hull. If we can win both of those, who knows? We might have one hand on that premiership crown. Cheers dudes. Spot night. Oh,